the 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 reduced his movement in the court and and his, uh, you saw how it affected the multimedia they got a loss so coming to game 3 i'm expecting them to have a different tactic that they used uh, in the previous game 2 what yeah, else take away that is i mean they have to change uh, they are, they don't have to change they, i don't expect the wilders to switch up as much but i feel like you know uh hamza and brian and uh, jerry being more aggressive and being more scoring options we because if they're able to be scoring options and you have like a guy like uh, leo and tim and you know gabu right there in the defense a bit you know uh blocking on the defense and let uh hamza brian be scoring options i feel like they'll have they'll i, I feel like they have a chance you know, oh i'm not in their training camp but this is just me <laughs> I'm not in the training camp so this is just me so um all, all I'm saying is this right I'm pretty I'm sure at this point in the season defense is going to take you far but you're not supposed to you know be a one-sided player and defend defend the ball a lot you have to you know take those shots I expect if if they got shots they have to take them if they have like um if Hamza gets open for a deep three I expect him to shoot the lights out from three just the same way as you know Danny Mbogo did to the Moisters you know that guy wasn't afraid to pull up from deep he was just you know the more you let that you, you more you let, you let that three go you know the better chance you got you know winning that ball game the more Brian you know you let that you you let your skill and athleticism inside the paint right there but, the more but, the more but, the more chance you got in, in winning this game so But remember, they, they, there's a problem again, playing against the Gorets. These guys take all the rebounds, almost all the rebounds. So uh, having having to shoot from three, then uh, give out the ball to the Gorets, who will take the rebound? They'll take the rebound offensively, defensively. Uh, how how will they fix that? Has been a problem. Taking 26 rebounds, two players, uh, yeah, another I mean, rim, multimedia needs to work on that. I mean. I mean the Wilders I expect like you know uh, they have to impose a bit of size under there I'm pretty sure they've got you know bodies to throw uh on those big on those guys who getting those rebounds but hey I mean if it's a matter of you know uh, uh uh getting rebounds I feel like the Wilders have the personnel to do it you know they've got team right there uh they've got a uh, Leo you know Leo is undersized but he can grab those rebounds he's he's a pretty scrappy guy you know he defensively we've got team right there that tandem we've got Jerry can you know double up as a two way player uh in his position he can be able to be a scoring option also a defensive option so i feel like they have to utilize they have to utilize Jerry both in, as a two way player in this game they have to do that yeah so I mean they have to figure that uh, out before Saturday. Oh, uh, this I think this is, is, is the most exciting match up this weekend because uh, if 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 played this uh, the previous weekend we could have been knowing who is going to be in the semi finals. Now we, we just left hanging to see what will happen on Saturday 3 p.m. Uh but you 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 have you have you have you have a team that uh has 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 Hamza in, in it a very good player uh, yeah, with true. him having the on button for Hamza means that the team will perform exceptionally well i mean uh, uh, they, they already know that they are, they, they they did it in game 2 they 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 are coming to game 3 and uh, if, if if they can <laughs> they can pull off what they did in game 2 it's going to be it's, it's going to be a pretty t- tight match Yeah, true. Uh just just in keeping with the conversation. I see Ulinzi Ulinzi basketball is watching this live video. Shout out to you. Massive shout out to you guys. I'm pretty sure uh you guys are, you know, preparing for the BAL qualifiers. Please be sure you know play hard, play strong. We support you. Uh we've got uh Lee LeBron Burn Shout out to you. you've got Muski Muski Joe in the chat is saying Bana Danny Mbogo came through with them trays true true true. Uh shout out to you Lumi Lumionix. Um I mean shout out to you guys. Also Strathmore Sports is joining us in the live. Hey thank you man. Shout out to you guys. Big shout out to you. I mean um shout out to you guys on the chat man. You know if you if you got something man just drop it on the chat we're going to talk about it. So yeah I mean Danny Mbogo and 
he was he, he was he was on fire on bro fire this weekend bro averaged 29 20 was it 25 or 26 points in that weekend i mean that guy was you know shooting the lights out of the moisture i mean the moisture had nothing on that guy you know my dog averaged seven blocks i mean all cylinders you, you've seen you've seen how matok has 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 this this playoffs it has been <laughs> has been consistent since the, the, the of, of the playoffs so i think matok 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 is, and having matok and done this this, this yeah. is great for him it's a good news for them i mean i don't know what happened but matok just switched up in the playoffs Did you know in the regular season he wasn't you know uh He wasn't that he wasn't like going on to the boards right as much but in the playoffs i mean this guy is getting rebounds this guy is getting blocks i mean he's just doing whatever i mean he's just imposing his will his length his dominance right down the court so i mean teams have to you know change their defensive strategies when that guy is in the court because i don't know if guys who are undersized then you know they are not able to you know close him out you know he's going to dunk on you if you, if he's not that he's going to you know get the pull get the offensive boards i mean he's he's long i mean teams have to you know find a way teams have to find a way to you know you know uh uh stop him from getting those rebounds but hey you know you know you can't teach height so you can't teach height so he's got the leg so and uh, so whoever will win against the gorilla and martin media guys it will will face NBK the following day that's uh, on Sunday uh, yeah. I, I I've seen I've seen I've seen NBK match up against Multimedia Wilders uh Dagoretti and NBK not yet uh, I, I don't want to put out my prediction right now but uh, this both these teams are are, are, are great teams uh, I, even this weekend I'm expecting like to see the match go to overtime but yeah that, true that's that's tell me I expect I expect Hamza I I I expect Hamza Brian uh Gabu team Leo uh Sam all those guys to you know come in and you know do their thing do that magic that has been working for you in the regular season show these guys why you're number 2 seed in the west I mean I next ex- I also expect the same energy from Dagrity High School show us why you're the number 3 seed bro show us come in and leave it all on the line because it's a win or go home situation the winner you know goes to the next side and is going to make going to face nbk and i feel like nbk have have had so much rest they've got two they have had two weeks rest so the game that you know they're going to you know have on sunday they're going to have fresh legs you know uh, not i mean they're just going to it's just going to be an easy game for them because you know they've had rest so i, ex- I expect I expect greatness this weekend so nothing short of that totally 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 because uh, NBK are, 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 are okay uh, we we had spoken earlier to Dan and uh, he as a, as a, as a, as, a, as a player he's mentally ready for for he he, he has this winning mentality so whoever is going to face them on Sunday having yeah. tired legs on Saturday the game is going to be very difficult for them That's I mean I mean just full credit to that team but one thing I keep one one thing I keep saying to myself especially in the playoffs if you if you if you have a team and you want to, you have one guy a guy who knows how to win I mean if you if you if you have a roster right there you have to have that player who knows how to win I feel like Danny Mbogo is on that list I feel like uh uh Monte Allen Kimba from Dagriti High School is on that list. I feel like um Brian is on that like, list. I mean, guys, Isamende is on that list. I feel like guys who 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 know how to win. That's what the playoffs, you know, that's what the playoffs, you know, wants to find out. Guys who know how to win, guys who know how to, you know, play good basketball and play winning basketball. They're not just no just the highlights, bro. Who who when the hit clock hits zero at the end of the fourth quarter who's on top now that's what matters that's what uh, matters yeah i agree with you like yeah. uh, i'm just i'm just waiting to see and oh you, you, you we had we had we had we had queen and jquet uh, i wasn't in earlier but uh 
Kui and Jaquat, uh, remember Jaquat, this is their first season, they're here, they're at the big stage, and they yeah. want to deserve to be on the big stage, and we have Kui, a great team with great cards, expect them to be on this stage, and uh, I see them even from, from, from the I mean, season. I mean this is the biggest this is the biggest stage in their careers. I mean this is the biggest stage in the in this point in their careers because you're matching up against Quay the juggernaut. I mean Quay, I mean with that tandem of Quark inside there, you've got KD inside there. I mean I'm telling you, uh Jaquat has to find a way. They have to find a way, you know, to to steal one game, to push it to to push it. they have to, they have to find a way to beat you know Kawhi Kimsa because that guy is relentless he's going to you know take the, those offensive boards those defensive boards if you've got KD there he's a sharp shooting marksman um sharp shooting marksman who can handle the ball i mean uh, Kawhi is just a threat inside threat inside they've got that point guard right there elite ball handling i mean Jake what this is going to this this going this going to be a challenge for them but you know i mean We just wait we just have to wait and see in game 1 this weekend. Uh this game is going to it's going to be epic. Yeah. Epic epic match up this weekend guys. Uh maybe to remind you guys on Saturday Strathmore Sports Complex turn up this is the semi finals guys of the NBA playoffs. Uh we, we've come a long way guys we've come a long way. The reason I think like, the yeah. that we do just edit. Just, just, just to hold on. Uh, there's a comment right here by Muski Joe. He's saying Dan gets hot, quick like Clay, Clay Thompson style. His catch and shoot rhythm is killer. Once he gets his groove, true. I mean, but I'm not gonna say he's a Clay Thompson because I feel like this guy is a is a one. So I can compare him to a guy like uh, Damian Lillard. I feel like he's, he's more Damian Lillard because you know Damian Lillard, you know, can handle the rock, penetrate. He, Dan in Bogota just the same thing handle the ball penetrate kick it put kick it out inside he can finish the layup he can go to the line you know i feel like this guy shoots like what like 85 to 90% from the line he's yet to miss uh, he 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 very efficient on the line guys are afraid to you know um guys are afraid to foul that guy because he makes all of his free throws And uh yeah I mean Danny Bogwa I feel like he's a Damian Lillard he's got that Damian Lillard gold package and also shout out to Hamza Hamza is on the chat I mean I see you boy I see you boy you know drop something on the chat bro I mean drop drop drop, drop something on the chat I see you bro I see you Roberto 2.1 join the chat I mean Eddie underscore DY 5442 join I mean Shout out to all you guys on the chat. I mean, shout out to all you guys. You are the reason why we're here. You are the reason, bro. You're the reason, man. You you are the true Hamza. I expect you to ball out. I don't I'm not sure if you 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 listening to this. I'm I don't know if you you watch you watch this whole, you know, show and start it, but I expect you to ball out Steph Curry style. Whatever. Whatever, bro. Yeah. But they uh my best guy in the league. currently Hamza Hassan Hamza there. I mean flat out I mean that guy you know he can shoot from deep I mean I must I'm just the match up that I want to see Hamza if I don't know if you're still watching but I want you to see who's the better point guard is it if it you or Danny Mbogwa who's who's better that's what that's the match up that's it's the battle between you two guys Danny Mbogwa versus Hamza who's the better point guard who's the better number one guy in the league Cause those, 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 that's 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 the matchup that I'm waiting for. That's why I'm picking you guys to win because I just want to see who's who's going to show who's the best. Who's the best point guard in this league? So, yo, so shout out to you Brian on the chat. I see you, bro. I don't know if you you if you caught this, but I expect you to be more aggressive, bro. I expect you to go to the line. I expect you you and Hamza to lead the Wilders to pass pass the pass the, you know, Pass the Dagriti High School team. I expect you to do that, bro. Shout out to you, man. Massive shout out to you, bro. Eric, on to you, man. I mean, <laughs> as I said that, like, Rudy now is, is 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 like we make our prediction. And so, yes, yeah, yeah, sure. Maybe we're gonna with the what game they do the MM Dagriti last. Yeah. And, Jaquan 
Koi versus Jackwood. I I'm a pick Koi, bro. I'm 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 Koi. I'm roll I'm rocking with those guys because yo, I mean <laughs> those guys those those guys those guys play hard, man. You got KD inside there, you got you know Quark inside, they got their point guard in there. So, you know, co coach uh, coach Chester, I feel like he, he makes the adjustments, you know, in as as they go deeper in the playoffs. So the way they match up with Kivuli, I feel like it's gonna be different because from the way they match up with uh, uh Jacob. So but I expect uh, Kuwait to, you know, make some noise right there. So yeah. I pick Kuwait. So, uh, game one, hands up, uh, I'll give it to Kuwait. Uh, I have no argue. I have like I can't I can't argue against against them playing Jacob game one. I'll give them the this game one. Uh, on to multimedia welders, Dagoretti High School. First, let me just uh, give the, the viewers a chance to know uh, the fans that the poll that we did earlier on our on our channel. Uh, the poll it was multimedia Dagoretti who's going to win and eighty eighty nine percent to Dago to multimedia welders and eleven percent to to Dagoretti High School. So, uh, you see, like majority of the people have welders welders backing up welders. This game three, but you know it's an ongoing poll. Please be sure to you know vote. I mean, vote for your team to make sure that you know they just rally behind those teams. This is an ongoing poll until Saturday, so please be sure to you know make sure that you know vote for that team. Check out our stories; it's all there. So uh, I'll, I'll 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 go with the Wilders. Give give Hamza uh, having Hamza Brian. Giving the team the rating that is supposed to be there, Wilders will take it any day. I mean, I feel like you know Brian, right there mm-hmm. leading the charge. You know Hamza leading the charge. That big three with that 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 three headed that 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 monster big three right there with uh, uh, Hamza leading the point. You've got um, you've you've got Jerry. You've got Jerry right there on the three. Um, okay. You've got, you know, I can I can put Brian at the I can I can put Brian at the at the two or three, depending on what lineup uh, Coach Alcatraz is gonna put up for it. But that big three, I expect them to, you know, make some serious noise in this game. I expect you know Brian to drop at least thirty points. Thirty. I mean, I expect a thirty piece, bro. I mean, even thirty five or forty or something. Yeah, man, it's close. Close them out. Close them out, bro. What's the what's the what's the deal? You 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 you've got the talent. You've got the you've got the skill. You've got the talent. You've got the ability to do it. I expect also from I expect the same from also Samende, Monte Allen. You know, Maluya one. I expect you guys to you know you've got the talent, you've got the skill, you've got the athleticism. Leave it all on the floor. That's what I gotta say, man. I picked. The, I'm rocking with the Wilders, bro. Yeah. Okay, so th- those are our two matches this week. Okay, and the. Uh... Uh, so uh, for the after after Saturday we, on Sunday we're going to have the Koi Jacob game two of the semifinals. Uh, so what's your take on that? Uh, who who do you think will win game two? Uh, game two, uh, Jacob Koi. Jacob Koi. I I don't know, man. Uh... I I I want to say I want to rock with Quay, but you know we just have to see how Game One plays. Like you can be able to you know gauge, even though they're also gonna meet like three times that week because it's Saturday, Sunday, and Wednesday, and also mid Wednesday, mid mid the week. So you know, man, I mean it's back to back to back. So we have to see Game One and Game Two first, so, you know. But I pick, I'm rocking with Quay Game One, right? Yeah, true. I mean. Yeah, man. I mean, that's great. Yeah, hands up! That 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 was, that was our time. You see, like people are, are still joining the chat. Yeah, I mean, Vic. Shout out to I me. Mean, let me just shout out a few guys. You know, shout out to uh, underscore Vic. Shout out to ask and uh, shout out to you, Ian Ian underscore Adoyo. Shout out to you guys on the chat. You're the reason why we're here. And uh, yeah, man. I mean, please be sure to you know check out them highlights. On Whoopi Sport YouTube channel, also Whoopi Sport Retro, and uh, yeah, man, both channels. That's the place where you're gonna see all those highlights of the playoffs. Uh, Whoopi Sport has been working day and night to make sure that you guys get all these highlights. So yeah, man. I mean, that's that's what it is. 
So that, that has been our time with me and Derito here at the re- re- relay show. And 